because not a lot of people have done it. They don't understand it, but it's a very, very gratifying feeling. Ginny has actually been a surrogate twice, first carrying twins for a single gay man, then for a single woman who couldn't have children. Helping other people have children was something Ginny says she'd wanted to do for years. I just couldn't imagine not being able to have children. So I didn't know anybody that couldn't have children. I didn't know anyone that had been a surrogate. I just thought I wanted to be a surrogate. And while you'd never guess it from meeting an outgoing all-American mom like Ginny, she and others like her are at the center of a controversy surrounding surrogacy. The fact that out of the 1,000 or so American women who do it every year, a disproportionate number are military wives. Active duty U.S. service members make up less than 1% of the U.S. population, yet it's estimated that at least 10%, probably more, of all surrogates are military wives. Why? Military wives are very determined, and when we say we want to do something, it usually will happen. And I do think there is an added benefit that there is insurance. Insurance is a big part of the equation because surrogacy is so expensive for intended parents. Anywhere from fifty to one hundred and fifty thousand dollars when you consider medical, legal, and travel costs. The fee to the surrogate ranges from twenty to thirty thousand dollars. So women who have insurance that will pay their doctor bills are a lot more attractive to prospective parents. But many insurance companies specifically state that pregnancy is not covered if the woman is carrying a baby for someone else. But TRICARE, the insurance provider for military members and their spouses, has a long history of paying surrogates medical expenses, meaning the intended parents don't have to pay them. Learn more at TRICARE.mil. For Ginny, filing for medical claims was simple. We just went to the hospital, had a baby, and TRICARE covered it. <laughs> but that, some critics say, amounts to taking advantage of TRICARE and, by extension, American taxpayers. What's your response to people who say you were cheating the system? I do feel that they should cover me medically for whatever it is. My, other, my husband's been overseas four or five times. This time is five times. My children miss out. I, I think that if it's a medical benefit that, that we would normally get, we should get it. If you've got it, watch it. If you don't, call your TV provider to get HDNet today.